Welcome back to my channel. Yes, yes. Okay, I am going to be doing um, some quick decorating tips. I'm going to be doing roses on a chocolate chip cookie. So how's all my go-getters been doing? How's everybody doing out here? Yes, I just want to spend time with you and just, you know, make something quick. I baked me six cookies because I'm not going to eat all these cookies, but I just wanted to show you some roses. Roses can go on cakes, cupcakes, cookies. This is my little chocolate chip cookie. And I must admit, it's, it's a little burnt, but we're not gonna show the back. Let me see which one. Oh, this one is not that bad. There's one of them that's really... Oh, yeah, these two. Yeah. But it is what it is. All right. So we're going to do our roses on the nail. And so what we do is we just turn it. We make a little mound. You see that? My little mound. We make it a little higher. I need to put a peak on it. There you go, I got a little peak. And then I'm gonna start my rose. One petal, two petal, three petal, four petal. I am a perfectionist when it comes to this. Yeah, and I'm not really feeling this rose, but yeah, we might get rid of you. Yes, we might get rid of you because I just like things to be right. Okay. We're gonna try that again. Yes. All right, we're gonna... All right, we're back again. I had to go get a rag so I could wipe off the tip because you don't want your tip with all the icing hanging from it. You want it to be a clean edge tip. So let's start this again. And we're going to make our mound go around. And then we're gonna go around again and bring it to a little point. Okay, then we make our petals. We're doing three petals at a time. One, two, three. And if the icing's getting soft, which it feels like it is. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna put that there and we're gonna take and lift our rose off with our scissors and place it on the cookie. You make a little mound for it and then you put it, you sit it down and then you go the opposite way. So that way you won't pull the rose off. Alrighty then. Then we're going to put some leaves on it. Some little green leaves. Just kind of dress it up. See? You got a little rose on a cookie. Okay, we're gonna try it again. You want to push your bag all the way down like this, turn it so you have like a ball and you have control over the icing. Take and clean your tip off. Okay, we'll grab another cookie and we're going to do the same thing. We're going to go around, we can make a mount like that where then we have our mount here. That's where we're going to sit out cookie at. That's where we're going to set our rows. We get our nail and we make a round. A mound, I mean to say. You want to get a peek to it. Okay. Then you start making your petals. In between each one is a petal. See? That is such a beautiful rose. That turned out really good. Then we're gonna take this rose off of here. Let me clean my scissors off. Okay. And we're gonna pull up our rose on our scissors and we're gonna sit it on this mound that we made right here. And remember I said, try to go away from the, uh, <clears throat> try to go away from where the angle of the icing is going. If you're putting it on there and the icing seems like it want to go that way, you try to move it around that way so you can swerve it around and you have an even, even base to your cookie. You just take your green, 
and you want to just kind of put your leaf in open spaces where it shows where you put it. And I normally use four. See? Very simple. That's your cookie. That's our lavender cookie. Then we're gonna make one more lavender because we have six cookies. Then we're gonna make three pinks and three lavenders. So let's finish our last lavender. Make my mound. And then I'm gonna show you how fast I can go with it. Okay. And then we're gonna take and ease it off of here. Uh oh, that's why I got an apron on in case I get messy. Ease it off of here and put it onto our cookie. Let's see. Put it onto our cookie. All right, and, it, and act like it don't wanna go. So boom, we was able to get that on there. Good, good. Okay, come on here. Don't get on my way. Shouldn't have had you here in the first place. Yes, okay, we got it on our cookie. We good, okay. So excited. Okay, and pull this back a little bit so you can see. And then we're going to put our leaves, leaf, and leaf. There you go. This would be really cute for like um, weddings and things, you know? Weddings, um, baby showers, where you could do something other than that, other than the cookie. Um, hmm, I might show you one of those. Baby booties on a, on a cookie. Okay, and we're gonna go make our mound. I'll just make one there, but make our mound. And there we go, our pink rose. Okay. Take it up off the scissor, place it onto the cookie. Okay, let me get this in my hand because it seems like it don't want to go. All right, there you go. And my hand got caught up in it. Okay. Oh, I got out of that. Yes, I got out of that. And our leaf. All right. These would be nice wedding cookies. Pick out your bridesmaid colors. I think it'll go great. So we're gonna try another, another one, another pink flower, another pink rose. Make a little mound. And then we just start turning. Like I said, we're making a little round mound. You get icing all caked up on there, take it off because it'll mess up when you're trying to make the petals. Now we wanna make a peak. Cause that's the that's the rose. Then you go and make your petals. I don't like the way that one looks. That's why you could take it off. Cause if your peak is not right, it just doesn't make it look like a rose. It has to have that point in the middle. So There you go. That's much better. It looks like a rose. Okay, then we're gonna take it off with our scissors once again. And we're gonna place it onto our cookie. Sit it down, take it out. You see if the, yeah, when, if the rose is trying to escape, then you have to maneuver it back together. Okay, so this is what we have. Rose on a cookie. Rose on a cookie. That's beautiful. Now, what we're gonna do is, I didn't bring out any of the colors, but I did bring a round tip like this. So with that, with this last cookie, I'm gonna show you how you can make it into like, 
You could use, you can have cookies. It could be sugar cookies, chocolate chip cookies, and you could use it for baby showers. If you was having a baby shower, you wouldn't have baby shower cookies. These right here could be wedding cookies, birthday cookies. It has a rose on it. But if you want to put a baby booty on it, let's see how that's going to go. I'm just going to do a pair of booties on this one cookie. And how I do my booties, I sh you're going to make like a teardrop where it comes down and back, down and back. You see that? And then we're going to go up. That's our little baby booties. So, since I didn't bring a whole bunch of tips in here with me, ooh, come on off, please come off. Oh my gosh, you do not want to come on. All right, I got this elbow with you. All right, so I didn't bring no extra tips in here. I just thought of the baby booties at the last minute. So, with that being said, we're going to put some strings on the baby booty with that same tip. Take this off. All right. With that same tip. And we're gonna put this pink on top of here. We're gonna squirt out the excess. And my stomach is making growling sounds because quite frankly, I think I'm hungry. And we're gonna get this purple out. Okay, all right. Come on, let it get light. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. And we're going to put some strings on the baby booty. The two strings. I'm going to put this around here so you can kind of see it. All right. So what we're going to do is we're going to put strings, a little bow string on the booty. And then we're going to put a little design up at the top. And then, oh, my apron fell open. There you go. We got our baby booties on a cookie. And we got our rose on a cookie. Nice and simple and sweet. Isn't that beautiful? So, ooh, the wonders of what you could do. Almost dropped it. Okay. So, with that being said, we're not going to hold this video up. I just wanted to show you some classy things you could do with a cookie and taste it. Hmm. Pretty good. Pretty good. So make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe down below. Hit that notification bell so you can be notified anytime I'm uploading a new video. Yes. Won't he do it? Yes, he will. Thank you, my subscribers, my go-getters. Thank you for watching. And please enjoy the rest of your day. Because I certainly will. Peace.